These robots are all the talk here on campus. I want to go ahead and show you one. There it is. Even in the rain, that can't stop these robots. There are 25 of them rolling around campus right now. There's 30 in all. They're really easy to use. All you need is to download an app and put in a form of payment, and these robots will come to you anywhere on campus. Although it seems simple, as we discover, there's still a learning curve for students. It's so cute. It's like a it's like a bigger Roomba that just gives you food. People actually they actually love the robots. <laughs> when you see the robot, everybody's like, oh my god, look, everybody's on Snapchat, everybody got their phone out recording. He's camera shy. <laughs> they're super cute and they're very polite. It's kind of cool to see that it actually works and it doesn't run into people. U of H is the first campus in the state of Texas to have its own fleet of autonomous delivery robots here on campus. Hello, here's your delivery. <laughs> Talks. It's like Uber kind of, you can pick your spot where you want to get it delivered and stuff. And it only took like 20 minutes to get my food. This is awesome, guys. <laughs> We've got 11 different locations uh, where you can uh, get robot orders from 7 a.m. until 2 a.m. Some of the big names include Panda Express, uh, Starbucks, uh, Mondo's, our sandwich shop. I heard the, the fee isn't too high, so. $1.99? Yeah, that's not bad has, I'm guessing, some kind of like sensors where it doesn't like run into anything. It has a bubble of awareness around the robot and it won't get too close to anything. I think it's really cool. Like, at first I was a little skeptical. <laughs> it, just, it just goes around and it does its little job. <laughs> or coos, we're, we're the best. Of course we have it first. Yeah, so U of H has it first, but is it only going to be here, U of H, in Texas? Or are more of these robots going to show up at, say, Texas A&M or University of Texas? Coming up at Eyewitness News at 6.30, we'll let you know if the company has any plans to expand here in the Lone Star State. How neat is that thing right there?